Did you know electric vehicles require way less maintenance than combustion-powered cars and trucks? <laughs> it's true, except in one critical area, and we'll cover that next here on EV Basics. Going electric is a great way to simplify your life. There's no oil to change, timing belts to replace, or emissions control systems to worry about. All that stuff, and a heck of a lot more, vanishes once you switch to an EV. But there are other benefits too. Electric cars and trucks are smooth, nearly silent, and they deliver instant off-the-line torque, which allows you to have tons of fun. Responsibly, of course or at least don't get caught. But it's also a double-edged sword. Having a big swell of immediate oomph at the tap of your foot is great for scooting around traffic, merging onto the highway, getting a heavy load moving, or like we once did, embarrassing muscle cars at the drag strip. But quarter mile times notwithstanding, even a normal amount of EV torque puts huge stress on a vehicle's tires. Furthermore, electrics are often significantly heavier than comparable ICE models, which further exacerbates tire wear. Now, some sources say EVs burn through tires anywhere from 20 to 30% faster than similar combustion-powered vehicles, and that's a significant difference as well as a substantial expense. Tires aren't cheap, and you will almost always end up replacing them more often if you own an EV, particularly if you drive hard, so be aware of that. I mean, burying the accelerator pedal in your Lucid Air Sapphire every time the light turns green will get pretty expensive pretty quickly, but I suppose if you can afford a Sapphire, you know, a new set of tires isn't going to send you into bankruptcy. Next up, though, I'll touch on what tire manufacturers are doing to combat accelerated wear, and I'll share a few simple tricks to help maximize tire life. But first, a few words from Michelin, our sponsor for this video. When it's time to replace the tires on your luxury heavy-duty pickup, like the Tesla Cybertruck and Rivian R1T, get a set of Michelin Defender LTX Platinums. Aside from an ultra-premium design that incorporates a velour sidewall treatment, these rugged tires are built for the long haul. In fact, the Defender LTX Platinum is designed to last twice as long as its predecessor and comes with a whopping 70,000 mile warranty. Additionally, you get the Michelin Promise Plan, a 60-day satisfaction guarantee that also includes three years of roadside assistance. Currently, the Defender LTX Platinum is available in six different sizes for 20-inch wheels. And to find the tire that's right for your heavy-duty vehicle, visit michelinman.com. You can also scan the convenient on-screen QR code, or of course, hit the link in the description box below. And we thank Michelin for their support of EV Basics. Now, here are a few suggestions to help you get the most miles possible out of your EV's tires. And tip number one is the simplest of all, maintain proper pressure. This is quick, easy, and cheap maintenance. If you're not familiar with how to do this, learn. All you need is a pressure gauge, which only costs a couple bucks, and an air compressor. Portable ones, of course, are very reasonably priced. In fact, your EV might even include one in lieu of a spare tire. Just check the trunk. And in fact, this right here came from our producer's Mach-E, and it's not just for emergency roadside repairs. You can twist the dial just like that to put it in air mode, and then you can use it to top up the pressure in your tires as required, because tires do gradually lose pressure over time Checking them regularly can increase their life, not to mention your safety and the safety of other road users. Driving with over or more typically under inflated tires is a terrible idea. This can cause handling and braking issues or worse, an unexpected blowout, a first class ticket to a terrible day. Next up, rotate your vehicle's rubber regularly. Every car and truck has different weight distribution and loading. Then there's front, rear, and all-wheel drive, variances that put different amounts of stress on the tires. 
Rotating them often can ensure they wear evenly and ultimately last longer. Tip number three, keep your wheels aligned. If your vehicle suspension is out of whack, it can quickly wear your tires down. It's not a bad idea to have a shop check the wheel alignment if you just hit a massive pothole or if you start to notice strange handling characteristics or unusual tire wear patterns. The good news is wheel alignments are usually pretty quick to get done and shouldn't cost too much, certainly a lot less than a new set of tires. Moving along, as I mentioned earlier, resist the temptation to drag race from every traffic light or stop sign. Drive sensibly and your EV's tires will last far longer than if you act like you're auditioning for the next Fast and Furious movie. Of course, if you take your Mustang to the racetrack, well, I think you know what you're getting into. And finally, tip number five is purchase EV-specific tires for your electric vehicle. Now, there's no need to throw out a perfectly good set that's already on your car or truck, but when it's time to get new rubber, seriously consider buying tires designed specifically for the needs of EVs. They should last noticeably longer, and you'll probably even get a little more range out of each charge, two factors that are tough to argue with. Manufacturers are hard at work engineering new rubber compounds, tread patterns, and construction techniques that prevent premature degradation. Michelin, again the sponsor of this video, offers Pilot Sport EV tires, for instance, which incorporate a range of features to extend tread life. The electric grip compound includes stiffer rubber in the center of the tire for greater traction and torque transmission. You know, so you don't turn your tires into plumes of smoke when you floor the accelerator. Additionally, Max Touch construction is another technology featured on many Michelin tires, and this helps distribute driving forces, braking, cornering, and acceleration more evenly to the road for longer tread life. Now, the company also has its Green Power Compound, a special rubber mix used on the shoulders of certain tires to increase efficiency for longer EV range and to help resist wear in heavier or higher performing vehicles. Michelin has developed many more innovations to reduce electric vehicle tire wear and increase range, and of course I'm sure other companies are hard at work addressing the same issues. And of course all these tips are frankly mostly common sense, and they are just as valid for combustion powered cars and trucks, so keep them in mind if you haven't gone electric just yet, and you'll probably save a chunk of change in the process. Obviously, treating your tires right isn't the only way to save money. The quickest option is to stop forking over your hard-earned cash to Electrify America or EVgo and start charging at home. Learn how to make that a reality by clicking right over here to watch this episode of EV Basics right now.